Samantha Cristoforetti's life journey began in Milan, Italy in 1977. As a child, she loved the typical things in life, birthday cakes, playing in the snow, being with friends and family, but it didn't take long for her imagination to take over. She found herself looking into the skies and wondering about life beyond, whether she was checking out a moon rock or creating and building something. She's the first to tell you that she was probably the only young lady in her little town who had an interest in space. By the time she was a senior in high school, she found herself in the United States, St. Paul, Minnesota to be exact, as a foreign exchange student, and that's how she made her way to space camp. No doubt, space camp played a major role in her life. Well, I had been passionate about space and dreaming of going to space and becoming an astronaut since, uh, as long as I can remember, I mean, since I was a little child. And um, at that point, I was uh, 18 year old. Um, I was an exchange student in Minnesota, so I was having already this incredibly exciting experience of being in a, in a foreign country, learning a new language. Um, and then, I don't even remember, I saw an advertisement of space camp somewhere, and I remember, you know, the, the woman I was staying with, the host mother, was very much aware of my passion for space, you know, I, and I just looked at it, and I, I raised up my eyes to her, and, and she's like, you want to go? And I'm like, yes, I want to go. <laughs> and then I, I arrived there, and it was this, this amazing, uh, amazing experience. I mean, that's the greatest time I've ever had, I had, ever had in my life up to that point. Samantha graduated from Liceo Scientifico in Trento, Italy in 1996. In 2001, she moved on to Munich, Germany, where she received a master's degree in mechanical engineering and joined the Italian Air Force. Then it was on to the Italian Air Force Academy in Naples, Italy. Her career in the Italian Air Force led her to fighter fundamentals training, but space was always her first love. In May of 2009, the European Space Agency selected her for the astronaut program. She completed basic astronaut training in November of 2010. In July 2012, she was assigned to the Italian Space Agency ASI mission aboard the International Space Station. Her mission? To be launched on a Soyuz spacecraft heading towards the International Space Station. Yeah, it, it, it's amazing. It, it's amazing. I mean, sometimes I have to pinch my, my cheeks to, to make sure that I'm not living in a dream, that it's actually, that it's actually true. Um, you know, I, I don't know how to describe it. I mean, for me, it's really a lifelong dream coming true, and it, it's been a long process. I've been selected as an astronaut five years ago, and I've been in training ever since. So, you know, I've, I've been growing enormously as a person, as a professional, with the help of an incredible community, because uh, uh, you know, there, there's not only astronauts, there's so many other incredibly interesting, challenging, demanding jobs that make the space program happen. And just two years ago, she visited the U.S. Space and Rocket Center to talk with space camp trainees. Her goal? To inspire them for the future. Uh, just, just, just go for it. Go for it and, uh, and maybe find ways like I did with space camp to um, you know, make sure that it grows stronger, that you keep it alive, that you uh, meet other people that have the same dream, that, you know, it becomes more real for you, you start finding your path as you, as you go along. Have faith that you will find your path and, um, and, and you know, and just try and give your best at, at, at what you're doing and one day the opportunity will come by. A dream come true. Samantha Cristoforetti, Space Camp graduate from 1995, preparing to board a Soviet rocket and head to the International Space Station. Her journey to space began here some 20 years ago, at Space Camp. And tonight, we honor her as the next inductee into the Space Camp Hall of Fame.